I'm Wynne Evans, you know. And I'm his brother Mark. And we're both opera singers. I'm a tenor. Ah! And I'm a baritone. <laughs> and apart from Italian music, we also love Italian food. In this series, we're going to be combining our two loves, music and food, as we head off to Italy for a mouth-watering musical feast. We'll be travelling to towns and villages from Sardinia to Siena and finding out how to cook like Mama, as well as sharing some of their musical treats as well. We'll also be meeting up with some locals as we sing for our supper. Che bella cosa! Come on, you! Artuna, Italy, here we come! Oh. Win. Off we go! Hang on, I need a helmet! <laughs> Win. wait for me! Before we depart for Italy, we need to take a break from being international opera singers. We need to knuckle down and become apprentices in the kitchen of our friend Severio, who came to Wales nearly 20 years ago. He takes pride in nurturing local talent, but his teaching methods are about to be pushed to the edge. Yeah, OK, we get the drift. If I was coming to your village and I met, say, your mama, what would she have taught me to cook? Uh, uh, pasta, but uh, we don't do pasta, egg pasta. We do plain pasta, just uh, flour and water. I'll show you how to make a <laughs> tortelloni. So, you take a square one, put a bit of uh, mascarpone. I'm going to copy you. OK, you do it like that. Yeah, over. So, over, and you make a triangle. Triangle, sorry. OK, is this one? And that's it, simple as that. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, I'm whoa, whoa, whoa. Have a go. What did you do at the end? You went. That's it, exactly. <laughs> My God, it's so, so good. Oh, so shut good. up about him. So good at everything I try so and do. It's just natural. Right, I want to see him do it. Okay. Perfect. Of course, it's perfect. You didn't do it. Come on, you. Right, it's very easy. You need practice. I haven't done it yet, so don't say that. <laughs> not too much. Not, so no, not too much. Triangle now. Triangle. Yeah, that's it. Triangle. Exactly, exactly. Then put. Then turn. No. Okay, yeah. that's it. Push like that. Okay. And then turn. Why no. do you need on the fly? Oh, that one there, there. Like a ring. Okay. Which is mine? That one. That's mine. I wonder what Mary Berry would that's say about that. Rubbish. Perfect. That's what she'd say. Look Perfect. at that. Perfect. Look at that. Look at that. If I have to judge, this wind. Yeah. So. Marking in this one. What? If you want your health rating to go to a zero, can we eat Mark's food? What about we put the pasta machine on and Wynne and I will see if we can make this pasta reach the length of the table. Okay. Right, go on. Right, you, you go down there. I'm on it. A lot of concentration. Come on, it's not the Bayeux tapestry. Get on with it. It's a bit of pasta. That could be in waitress. That oh, that's so mean. Flight disaster. No, Win is a proper chef. Yeah. I have to say, Win is the winner. Nailed it. I'm going home. So you're the chef and I've got to sing for my supper. Before we've eaten all the raw pasta, I've been interested to put some boiling water on, whilst little brother has been allowed to have the butter and olive oil. Oh, that smells fantastic. So the butter and the sage together. Four minutes and pasta is ready. Because the pasta is so fine and so beautiful. So what's this dish called? Has it got a name? Uh, tagliatelle with the fresh sage. Tagliatelle alla salvia. Bit of parmesan. What do we think, it's a very Oh, nearly came out of the pan. <laughs> Good. Honestly, it tastes so different. Now, after the antics of cooking a simple tagliatelle, we move on to my tortellini and ravioli. Seen as the boy blunders and did in, well, a blunder. Look at that. Even the ones there that were a little bit rustic and um, they're, they're okay, aren't they? They're holding together. You know, you cover with the sauce, so look, this is perfect. <laughs> yeah. 
How come that the mascarpone doesn't just melt? It's because it's sealed. There's two ways. It's like a sandwich. Look, this is perfect. Mm. That's one of mine. That looks like a shop boy. Mm. Okay. I'll put them on here. Well done, Mark. <laughs> All that's needed now is a sprinkling of sage and a good handful of parmesan. Look at that. That's a sprinkling, isn't it? And that's it. Yeah. Severio, salute. Thank Avanti. You for today. Avanti Italia. Avanti Italia. See you soon. Yechida. That's Welsh for cheers, in case you were wondering. Pains me to say he's much better at this pasta making than I am. Oh, really good. We didn't do bad at all. I'm an excellent chef. <laughs> I'm really very good. You're full of something. Yes. I think when we get to Italy... You'll find your feet. I'll find my feet. It'll all, it'll all pan out and uh, we'll see who comes out top dog. You know, the prob I know the problem is you're not eating enough. <laughs> no, if you ate a bit more... You'd appreciate the food a bit more. Shut up. No, seriously. Perhaps Wynne's confidence will be brought down a peg or two when he's face to face with the diners and has to wait on the tables. I'm going to be my element. Here we are. It's almost I'm going a la carte. Look at that. Look at that tea bus there. Eh? Oh, hey. What have we got your chef? Table six. six. Yeah. Grazie mille. First order in and confusion from the start. Where is table six? Hello. I've got your food. Good evening. Things seem to be going very well. People are responding well to our Welsh patter. Waiting tables is just like another performance. If I was a condemned man, that would be my last meal. Here we are, madam. Who's ordered the Philly steak well? Eat your fish and enjoy your food. I saw the chef just make it. Delicious. Enjoy. Now, this service seems to be going from first class... Mozzarella salad? Definitely. ...to overly familiar... Who's having a gin and tonic over here? ...to downright critical. <laughs> I've seen the white bit, right? It looks really bad. So the mozzarella, best choice of the night. Perhaps we're getting a little bit too informal. Careful on the way home now. Don't trip over, because there's a lot of gin in there. Well, hey, those tomatoes don't cut themselves. Excuse me, madam, I know this doesn't happen in most restaurants, but can I try your wine? <laughs> You've chosen a nice drop there. Thank you very much. Mm, delicious. What do people think of our pasta-making skills? On a score of one to ten, what are you going to give us on that? Uh, nine and a half. Nine and a half? We made that. Ten, that's more like it. Nine that was celebrity shallow. pasta. Very nice. Our first go at it. As the evening progresses, our services become more personal. And what's your name? Julia. Hello, Julia. Hello. I'm Mark. Nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. you too. Oh. Very lovely. I'm Wynne. Good to see you. Don't worry about him. Why Don't do you need a spoon? Well, I like to twist it on the spoon. It's oh, come on. You're not yeah, you're not sexy. Come on. No. But that is the proper way, though, to do it. Way. Yeah. My grandparents would yeah. have liked it that way. Yeah. Okay, so I can't really do it like this now. Do Are you, you engaged? Uh, no. No, excellent. <laughs> With the diners relaxed and the Chianti flowing, it's time to find out what Severio really thinks of our service. But you, you, you have a confidence, you know, you really, uh, and people like you very much. What's the, the protocol when it comes to taking a young lady home? Are we allowed to? We've made our supper, we've served the supper, I guess now it's time to sing for and our now supper. We'll sing it and then we're going to do our food. Perfect. Come on then, Marco. Let's go and sing a song. The stage is set. Let's hope the diners will be as pleased with us as they were with the food. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, how are we? Hello. I can't hear you. How are we? Yeah. Marvellous, marvellous. Now, uh, many, some of you may not know, but my name's Wynne, this is Mark, and um, we're actually brothers. Sorry. You know, we're actually brothers. Were you saying sorry to me? Um, we're actually brothers. I, I know we're not identical twins, uh, but we are brothers. Uh, there was one very subtle difference when we were born. Uh, Mark had uh, formula milk and I had breast milk. <laughs> and that was literally the only difference, wasn't it, love? Uh, no, you ate more than me. And I ate a lot more, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, we're going to sing the gendarmes duet now for you to set off your evening and hope you have a lovely time. <laughs> You know, it is lovely to see so many people filming it because I am looking forward to coming to your place of work tomorrow and filming you doing your job. That was a joke, by the way. No, you can carry on, love. 
She's there, oh, it's on Facebook Live. I don't believe this, you messed it up. Sometimes a duty's extra mural. And little butterflies we chase. We like to gamble in things rural. Commune with nature face to face. And so they beat them back return. Refreshed by nature's holy charm. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll show them when I'm old gendarme. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll, run them in. we'll show them when I'm old Lovely mover. If gentlemen will make a right, I'll punch each other's heads at night. Oh, we're quite disposed to keep it quiet, provided that they make it right. But if they do not seem to see it, or give to us a proper turn, we'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll run them in. We'll show them where the bulls are not. We'll run them in, we'll run them in, we'll run them in, we'll run them in, we'll show them where the boat of pasta making and working the tables in a restaurant has given us an insight into another world. And if every Italian we meet on our adventure is as happy and as helpful as Severio, then we're in for a treat. Thank you very much. Enjoy your dinner.